Bloop. Hey guys, welcome back to a mega fully loaded tweet tap where we follow everyone so you don't have to. Responding to the backlash following his Newsweek article about President Barack Obama, Neil Ferguson tweeting, my Newsweek piece has generated a rather febrile, febrile, febrile response from the liberal blogosphere. Here's why they're wrong. Wire us with your response to Neil Ferguson's recent article and all of the controversy that it's generated. Writer and blogger Talia Ralph highlighting a very serious problem in our country with food consumption and waste. Americans throw out up to 40% of their food each year. Sad. Check out a link to the news article in the description below. Activist EJ Scott tweeting about a new initiative that he's undertaking with his girlfriend Deborah Ann Wall from True Blood to raise awareness for choroideremia, a very rare genetic degenerative eye disease that he's suffering from. Running 12 marathons in 12 states in 2012, all blindfolded. To raise awareness and funding for this very serious disease. I'm asking everybody to please retweet this and encourage others to share as well. Very important message. Thank you. In environmental news, Bette Midler tweeting with one of the best hashtags of the day. New York Restoration Project team heading to San Francisco to learn from Al Gore's climate reality. Stay tuned on Twitter for updates. Hashtag I'm too hot. Yes, you are. <laughs> Lieutenant Governor of California, Northern California native Gavin Newsom tweeting Petaluma's Little League team, The National. Congrats to Petaluma. Let's go all the way. Petaluma is advancing to the next game in the Little League World Series after beating out New England in a 5-0 victory. Pete Cashmore from Mashable tweeting a link to a great new piece about the election coverage in 2012. YouTube wants to be your go-to for election coverage. And to check out YouTube's election hub, click right here. Click. Please. In entertainment news, Chad Kroger, the lead singer of Nickelback, proposed to Avril Lavigne last night. Entertainment writer Morgan Murphy tweeting, Avril Lavigne and Chad Kroger have requested that in lieu of wedding gifts, everyone stop laughing uncontrollably at them. <laughs> and finally, a tweet from one of our very own Waywire followers, Punjabi boy tweeting, when I call my parents and they don't answer, it's no big deal. But when they call me and I don't answer, it's like World War II. We want to hear what you think, so tweet us at Waywire, tweet me at Farooq Shemtov, subscribe to Waywire, and sign up on waywire.com.